I'm so confused by Saweetie's place in the music industry because it just doesn't make sense to take. Boy, do I have a story for you. So I've been working in production for the last seven years and I have a story about Saweetie. Um, and I'll have a lot more stories to come about my experiences of being a talent liaison and working with your favorite artist. So Saweetie, um, I got assigned to her and Megan The Stallion. Here is my evidence. I had to do signage all over the Capital One Arena here in Washington, DC. I'll give you one more example. And here's another example, having all access for the Jingle Ball working in production. So yeah, back to the story. So I got assigned to Sweetie and Megan The Stallion and I was literally shitting bricks because I was so excited to work with both of them. More Megan, but love Sweetie too, she's for the culture. So Megan literally flew in to the DC show like graduating the day prior. So I was like, you know, she may not be in the mood, but when I tell you, she had the nicest personality. Megan, I love you. If you ever see this, you are a gem to work with. You are so sweet. Sweetie was another, another situation. So I accidentally deleted what she needed in her dressing room, green room, but the main things were Hennessy, green tea, honey, and uh, don't mind my nail, and uh, cut up lemons, right? So when Sweetie and her entourage and her manager checked in, I made sure to go to her room, knock on it and ask her, hey, can I get you guys anything else? Does your room look okay? They cracked the door this much and her manager said, we need more lemons. Boom, slammed the door on me. I said, what? So I'm over here running around. I had to go to craft services and ask them. They're making our lunch. And I say, do you guys have any lemons? They hand me a whole lemon. And I said, I need to cut up for an artist. They handed me a cutting board and a knife. So I stood there and I cut lemons for Sweetie. I cut like five lemons and I put them in a cup and I ran back to her room, right? I get back to her room. I have the cup full of lemons. They open the door again this much, grab the lemons, slam the door. I'm like, what the fuck? How much lemons does she need to go on stage? Girl, it's not like you Beyonce. You ain't doing no Adele, okay? You singing over a track and shaking that ass. So I was a little bit confused, but I ended up going next door to Megan's room and hanging out with her for a while because her energy was good. Long story short, I had to walk Sweetie and her manager to the stage. I had the flashlight and I'm like this, walking to the stage, very important job. As I'm walking, I turned around to look at Sweetie. She's eyeing me up and down, me mugging me. I'm assuming because I have a fat ass and she wish she had it, but it doesn't matter. Long, long, long story short, I'm on TikTok recently and I see Sweetie saying she uses lemon slices as deodorant and that's why she needed so many lemon slices. So I cut up all those lemons for Sweetie to use them as deodorant and have a mean fucking attitude. Hmm. Well, hope they serve her well. So dumb right now. The fact that she keeps uh, cursing is ridiculous. I'm going through my camera roll, so, you know, so, you know, okay, so, first she said, My experiences of being a talent leader. Huh. And okay, first of all, you're professional. Let me just say that. That's the first thing I gotta say. Bricks, because I was so excited to work with both of them. More Megan, but love Sweetie too. She's for the culture. So Megan literally flew in to the DC show, like graduating the day prior. So I was like, you know, she may not be in the mood, but when I tell you, she had the nicest personality. Megan, I love you. If you ever see this, you are a gem to work with. You are so sweet. Sweetie, what? Okay. So you're a talent liaison, right? And so you're a professional. You work with close with ma pretty mainstream, pretty much mainstream celebrities, or at least for this instance you have. Okay, so if you expected Megan to be not in the mood, kind of just irritated, you know, I, I mean, my definition of not in the mood would be irritated not really saying nothing kind of just not there not with everybody so if you expected megan to be like that what what about sweetie or why couldn't what if something happened and she was acting that way because of uh of not graduating but like something <laughs> i don't know much and the way she keeps saying, like, they opened the door, they did this, 
they did that. I thought it was just Sweetie, her manager. Or she might have said her, her like, posse or squad or something. I'm not sure, but, uh, why she keeps saying they? Maybe I'm mistaken. Grab the lemon. It was and another part. I, had I turned around to look at Sweetie. She's eyeing me up and down, me mugging me. I'm assuming because I have a fat ass and she wish she had it, but it doesn't. Okay. <laughs> How are you a professional? And you a talent liaison. And you expect for, you work with such celebrities and you expect some to not be in the mood, but have higher expectations, I guess, for other people. How the hell are you on TikTok? As a professional woman, you're supposed to be anyway. I don't know what she is. <laughs> she said what she was, but not talking like this. The way she's telling the story, she gets hater vibes. And who the hell says, oh, I had a fat ass, so she must be mad. What, girl? Who are you? Aren't you a professional? What the? F I had a fat ass, so she must be in jail. So that I said, I don't know. What? Girl, you sound stupid. Long story short, I had to walk, sweetie. Not saying you won't get hate for that, but what? This sounds so dumb. Her manager to the stage. I had the flashlight. You sound so stupid. And I'm like this, walking to the stage, very important. I see sweetie saying she uses lemon slices as deodorant, and that's why she needed so many lemon slices. So I cut up all those lemons for Sweetie to use them as deodorant and have a mean fucking attitude. Hmm. Well, hope they serve her well. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I'm about to go. <laughs> this is so... Well, she is so dumb. All right, bye.